Hey, paisanos, it's-a me, Mr. Luigi. And before we begin, I would just like to say thank you to everyone who voted on the new LP. And to those who may be disappointed by what was chosen, I would say do not worry, because the other options will be done as an LP immediately following this one. But without further ado, you read the title, you know what's coming. I would like to welcome you to the LP of my username. Whoops. Yoshi's Woolly World Blind. My goodness, that was a mess up. I'm not cutting that. That, that was too good. Now, this is the part where I would usually ramble about, about and say, my apologies that this is a camcorder LP, I don't have a capture card, yada yada yada. But, most people usually know that at this point. So, without further ado, let us go. I know a lot of people will be saying, why have you never played this game before? For some reason, this is a, I remember this, I was hanging out with my friend... Zach, and he was staying over at my house, and we ended up getting this game and a few others at GameStop to just play and record. No, not play. I mean, not record. We just played them just to have some fun, and for some reason, I never finished it after he and I played it. I've played like the first three levels. That is all I've ever done. But without further ado, let's start a new game. Um, I've played the original Yoshi's World or Yoshi's Island. I think we'll go with classic. Gonna be playing on the gamepad. Let us begin. Welcome to Craft Island, a tiny place in the middle of the handmade ocean. Life here for the Yoshi clan is nothing but peaceful and le le leisurely. I'm sorry, I cannot talk. Or rather, it had been nothing but peaceful and leisurely until... Yoshi's? Sorry to drop in so suddenly, but I need to turn you all into yarn. Thank you. Well, at least he was polite about it. Wait, was that... S that was the same sound effect for Sonic Spin Dash. Play that back. That, that was definitely Sonic Spin Dash sound effect. Yeah, at this rate, I'll be here through lunch. Come on, I'm busy. Everyone becomes yawn. Aren't we already? No, not the cow one. He was my favorite. There, this should be plenty. Well, I better get back. Doodles. Uh oh. One survived! Two survived! Stop him! Why he doesn't just turn them into yarn and take them along as well, I have no idea. Eek! That's quite enough! I had it with you annoying Yoshis! There's still hope. As Kamek flees, flies away, he drops a handful of yarn. A rather important Yoshi meeting is held. 
What do I do to save the others? We need to get back to the yard. Boy, after that naughty trickster. And so, another grand Yoshi adventure begins. What, will they be able to knit their friends back together? Onward, Yoshis! Alright. So now we got control of our little Yoshi friend. Let's see what's around here. What do you have to say, good sir? Just walk away slowly. How about you? Good on you. Uh, what's here? Scrapbook theater. Amiibo hut. Let's look, check this out. Amiibo hut. Once you land... Once you load an amiibo, its design will live here. So come anytime to swap your design. Okay. Uh, I think I've got an amiibo right here. Um... Let's go ahead and load it up, see what happens. Apparently, it doesn't... It's not... Gosh darn it. It won't work with the game. Uh, give me a sec here. Technical difficulties. I'm gonna just grab a different one. Um, can't see since the lights are off. Um... How about you? We'll go with you. Okay. I have a different amiibo now. Let's see how this one works. Toad Yoshi! Oh, he's so cute! He looks like Toad. You know what? I think that's what's gonna happen. Every episode, I'll begin by changing Yoshis. So each episode will be a different Yoshi. Because, Lord knows, I've got enough amiibos to last the entire series. <laughs> Let's go! Whoops. There we go. Now, you will have to forgive me, because since this is a blind Let's Play, I hope a lot of you will be able to not rip your butts that much when I tell you that this won't be 100%. This is just going to be me going through the wonderful cuteness of this game because that is the word that has been used so many times when describing this game. Cute. Um, I do know about the collectibles in there. It's basically like, like any Yoshi game. My goal though is to collect all of the balls of yarn in a stage. That is what I consider to be a completed stage, is that I collected all the balls of yarn. I may not collect all of the sunflower badges or the Mevo stamps or finish with 20 lives, but my goal is to do that. So without further ado, let's jump into world 1-1. Yarn Yoshi takes shape. Solo start. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yon. Oh, there's that creepy drawing again. Yoshi! Oh my gosh, it looks beautiful. This actually does look really beautiful. Hello. Like I said, I have played a little bit of this game. And I have played the other Yoshi games before, so I know the logistics. Eat stuff with your tongue, turn it into a ball, use said ball to attack the other enemies. Before it was eggs, but you know, now it's yarn balls. So, it's pretty easy to understand. Wait. Why are the piranha plants the only thing that doesn't seem to be made out of here? Oh, pipe. Oh, that's cool. It actually travels down with it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm just gushing over everything at this point. The music is sounds wonderful. 
The enemies look so cute, you don't want to kill them. Even though I just did. What do you have to say, buddy? Flutter jump. Hold down A to flutter through the air for a short distance. Oh, okay. Not gonna get... I swear, that is the sound effect that they use for Sonic the Hedgehog when he revs up his spin dash in the original games. Think I'm lying? Look it up. Like, find a sound clip of the game and then play the two back, back to back. It sounds exactly like that. Must be something. Oh, hello. Oh, I found something down there. Cool, we can make platforms. Oh, what's back here? Oh, more beads. I wonder if we can do it up there, too. That's so cool, the platforms actually change color depending on what ball of yarn you... It's like, I've got a red ball in there, so let's get the red ball out here. Yeah, it makes a red platform. That's so neat. Got that. It's basically like a big ball of spaghetti. Like, I don't know about everyone else, but for me, whenever I have spaghetti, I cannot have anything but the big strands. I remember the first time I had big strand spaghetti. I actually did not think it was good enough, so, of course, I was alone in my house, so I was allowed to do this. I took two strands of spaghetti and actually tied them together to give the, uh, give the look of a longer spaghetti strand, and it actually looked. To this day, I can't wait for the fact that someday I will be able to do the Lady and the Tramp thing. What do we got here? Hey! Another yarn ball. What do you guys have? Hearts? Hearts? Oh no, it's a present. Ah, oh, it's a flower. Of course I'm gonna inevitably collect all of them in this level since it's the first level they make it so easy. Again, the whole game seems pretty easy. Because it's not about difficulty. It's about having fun and enjoying... Just... Everything being so happy. And I'm going... To hate myself, because... It is inevitable I'm going to make references to Nintendo Capri Sun. Because he's basically the... Guy. Who does Yoshi. He is the Yoshi guy. The so happy guy. The take a dump... Oh! Oh my gosh. This is just so cool. I don't know if any of you have seen it. I know I posted it on Twitter uh, when I was given it. But for my birthday, the other, yes, my friend Emma, she made me this cutest crocheted meowth. And just seeing all of this remind just thinks of what else could be done with this. Like seriously, everything in this game looks like someone could actually create it given the resources and time. Yay, more beeps. I don't even know what the Mifor stamps are really considered. Hey, got all of the fuzz balls. Aha! Secret. The biggest sunflower in the universe. Hey, I got all the sounds. I think I'm missing one more thing. You know what? Just because. It's the last level, the first level. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh thank goodness. Oh thank goodness, thank goodness. I was gonna say, I was gonna try to find the last... Some sunny badge, whatever you call it. I 
Okay. Last one was the in. This little walking is so cute. Listen. Sounds like, you know, yawn rubbing against yawn. Nope, nothing there. Well, I bet it has something to do with this wall over here. This isn't, like there's an invisible wall or something. I can't seem to find it. And of course the comments of Never mind! Oh my gosh. The, the subtitle to this episode is just gonna be <laughs> Starting off with a bunch of fails, so something about fails. Anyway, in true Proton John fashion now, we're gonna take a ball, leave a ball. Before it was eggs, now it's balls. For landing on the sunflower, we get a bonus game. Nice. Now we can look at the results. And of course, being the first level, it's like almost impossible to 100%. Even though I somehow found the ability to, I was about to give up on finding that last sunflower. But it's a good thing I did, because I get the bonus game. Now watch me botch it. What are we going to get? Oh, grab all the fruits. Alright. Uh, apples. Oh, watermelon! Watermelon! No, 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 give me the watermelon. Give... I don't care if I got... At least I got the watermelon. I got the watermelon. Alright, 19,000 gems into our pocket. Drawings. I'm sorry, I don't mean to sound rude to the people of Miiverse, but seriously, is it just bad luck that I'm getting the... Oh, what's this? You got a power badge. That lets you skip courses. Use it in mellow mode. Probably won't be using mellow mode that much. Oh, what do we got here? <gasps> we made a Yoshi! Sunflower Yoshi. Is that its name? Fl oh, just Flower Yoshi. Yoshi had just appeared on Craft Island. Who's in there? So the game gives you different Yoshis to look at if you don't have any amiibos. That looks nice. I'm, I think at the end of the game, we'll take back and reminisce on all of these Yoshis that we found. But during the game, like I said, I think I have enough ami amiibos. And if not, um. I'll find a way to work with it. Maybe we will start using these Yoshis. Because I don't know how long this game is. I, on the, off the top of my head, don't know how many... Oh, I have to collect all the sunflowers to unlock a secret level. I'll make a bo bonus video. I don't know how many amiibos I have off the top of my head. But without further ado, I know we only did one up, one level. But I think that should do it for the very first episode of my blind LP of Yoshi's Woolly World. Oh, I know. Doing all of my endings. I'll look in here and we'll remin reminisce. Yeah, that would be good. So thank you so much for joining me on this video. By joining me, I mean you clicked on the video. And I hope you guys are excited for what's it in store for this game because I know I truly am so far like I said it does seem kind of easy but I'm sure since it was just the first level it'll get pretty tough and I do agree with everyone this game does look super cute so I know I'm excited to continue this I hope you are and until next time this is Mr. Luigi signing off